Having an irrigation system at home makes life a lot easier in terms of watering. And if installed and planned correctly, you're able to get a more accurate measurement of how much water you've applied compared to with a hose pipe. However, as easy as a basic system is to install, they do require a bit of maintenance, both preventative as well as reactive as time goes by. Let's have a look at some of the common maintenance issues. Now many homes use municipal water for watering, but a lot do use harvested rainwater or borehole water, and this water should be filtered. Unfortunately, filters do need replacing, and if your filters are looking like this, then it's time to replace them. Clogged filters are ineffective in trapping dirt particles that wash off the roof, and this leads to the next problem, a blocked spray nozzle like this one. Cleaning them is really easy. Simply turn on your irrigation system and remove the blocked nozzle. This will tell you immediately if the blockage is within the nozzle or in the thin PVC tube. Here we can see that the water flows quite well, so the blockage is in the nozzle. Now using a needle, just gently scrape and prod until you get all the debris out. And here it looks like some soft plant matter got in and it's actually decomposing. Sand is often a culprit, hence why filters are important. Now if you find you have a blockage in the PVC tube, carefully remove the tubing from the main line and gently push a thin piece of wire through the pipe. If you can't unblock it, get a roll of new piping, cut a length required and join it with a connector. Now pipes do burst or fall victims to garden forks and spades. Yes, I've done it. Repairs are really simple. Just cut the pipe as close as you can to the hole and join it using a straight coupler like so. This is a push on fitting. Care should also be taken with weed eaters and lawnmowers as these can cut and damage the piping. Hence why buried pipes do have an advantage. In fact, there's a bunch of clips with links in the description below that all form part of an irrigation series, including how to install a basic system if you don't have one already. Now builders have a wide range of irrigation and gardening supplies to get your garden in top condition, both in store and online at builders.co.za. For more videos like this, check out the blog on the website. Get to builders, get it done.